I'm Valerie Juarez in Ocanto Falls, where today we're bringing you an update on a story we brought you last month. Ocanto Falls Public Schools continue to be faced with a school bus driver shortage. And now it's directly impacting on how some students will be getting to class. What grade are you going into? Second. And are you excited for that? Yeah. It was an exciting day in Ocanto Falls, where students like seven-year-old Max Caravu made their way back to the classroom. But what Max and his mom, Brienne, were not so thrilled about was how they would get to school. A little bit tired, I think. <laughs> what child? Just ready to get to school? My feet old. The family now has to wake up extra early to walk about 1.3 miles. That's because the school board suspended bus transportation for students living within one mile of a central location to the schools. Brienne is nervous for her son to be walking alone. As you can see, it's pretty pretty busy right here on the street. So this is actually the main street that I was concerned about because it's 22. Um, but like there's no sidewalks on that side. So I'm gonna have to cross this way and then cross this way and go this way because I don't want to I don't want him walking in the street. <laughs> Oconto Falls Superintendent Dean Hess said that while it's not the ideal situation, the district is trying to do all they can. And I was at one of the intersections this morning just so I could get a first-hand understanding of the level of traffic and the number of students that were crossing. The Oconto Falls Police Department released the following map, advising students who are biking or walking to school to use the safe routes highlighted in yellow. We had people out and about this morning. Um, we did a collaboration with our staff as well as the city and the police department to try to be more uh, visible at intersections and trying to recognize what are going to be the hazards for kids. And today, Brianne said, these additional steps do give her a little more of a peace of mind. Yeah, it's a little bit more helpful. Um, makes me nervous though, him doing it by himself. So, because he's just so little. In Oconto Falls, Valerie Juarez, NBC 26.